the red hot Philadelphia 76ers from the Wachovia Center just a few minutes away from downtown Philly. Welcome everybody, I'm Brett Musburger with Bill Walton. Bill, the red hot 76ers, that means you know who, Allen Iverson. They're surging, they're playing since the All-Star break, this terrific basketball, four and one, it's all because of Allen Iverson, even though everybody else is contributing mightily, but Allen Iverson on Wednesday night was once again his spectacular self. Down in Houston, a team surging the Houston Rockets, but Philadelphia, which has not played well on the road this year, Allen Iverson and his mates just took him right to him. An analysis of the numbers from Wednesday night, 40 points, tremendous field goal percentage, pounding the boards and dishing it out, and the Wizards won by five. And now they got a critical game tonight against Washington. Yeah, the Wizards have had their number. They've won three of the last four, including two in a row this year. Gilbert Arenas, one of the great scorers in the league. And the reigning Eastern Conference Player of the Week, two times over, Brent. The two-time All-Star Gilbert Arenas these days is playing as well as anyone in the league. The fourth leading scorer in the NBA, his ability to get to the free throw line. The stroke from the perimeter, everything happening right now. It's got to be Gilbert Arenas, who will take it head-to-head -to, -head to Allen Ivers. In the last five games, Arenas has been spectacular. He averages 28-8 on the season, but he's been well over that, almost five and a half points more, shooting a great field goal percentage and dishing it out to his mates. Critical game tonight, Brent. And the starting lineup is built for the Wizards, Antoine James and Brendan Haywood and Karan Butler up front. And in the backcourt joining Arenas, Jared Jeffries has a slight leg injury. He's going to try it, though. And for the home team, Chris Weber, Stephen Hunter, Andre Iguodala up front. And in the backcourt, Iverson is joined by the veteran Kevin Ollie. Let's check in with the third member of our team, Mark Jones. Mark? I'm going to play devil's advocate. Okay, that's okay. fine. You hey, know, you know it, I'm going to say that Allen had his chance at a long... I will always allow you to have <laughs> your say. And uh, we'll hear from him a little bit later in the broadcast. This is Arenas right here, one of the great scorers, oh. scooping in. Gilbert Arenas, last time we had him on ESPN. Glad you can bring me up to the college game, uh, up to speed there, Brent, because I don't know enough about the college game. Look at Iverson. I mean, Only if you want to, big fella. I mean, at least back to the hotel, or do we <laughs> yeah. have to sit no, right here? No, we can go back to the hotel. Okay. <laughs> Iverson. That's what I mean. On the, uh, on the jump shot. We'll lead him over to the bench as we take a look at the All-Star, Allen Iverson. Does it from a variety? Not about Allen Iverson. They said he gave his all, went to practice on time, worked hard for Coach Larry Brown and the assistants. And there is no player on the list who has done more, who has accomplished more. Can't even about those things. Well, Billy King, first class guy. And there is Allen Iverson demonstrating what he might be able to do in Beijing. No transition hoop for Arenas. Take it up. That's a two. If your longest current streak in the NBA. Their other problem is lack of bench performance. Allen Iverson. Oh, Jesus. So it was Allen Iverson leading the way with 13 first quarter points for the Philadelphia 76ers against Washington. Let's take a look, Bill. And he did it in a variety of ways. Down the lane, through four and five defenders, teasing the big guys. Allen Iverson scored the last nine points of the quarter for the last three minutes, 30 seconds. The perimeter jumpers, the three-point ball, leading the defense. It's all happening for Allen Iverson right now. Allen Bear still trying to play himself back into uh, back into shape, it looks like, Bill. As uh, Arenas at the other end is short, gets his own miss coming to crew, and he puts it back. So a second chance point. Took the Wizards back into the playoffs after a long drop. They lose Allen Iverson there. Would think that Arenas would have learned. He instead he headed right for James Caper. Bothered by this one. I'm so glad that the refer that the NBA came uncles who all played college basketball the way they worked on his game on his shot and sure paid off there. Here comes Iverson to Iguodala. Over the top. The ability to give it up early and then get it right back. Where's the transition defense, please? Give him the slam dunk title. <laughs> Come on, let's be fair. I could. Iguodala slides free again. A candidate for the United States national team. As will Gilbert Arenas. 
Oh. And Iverson still hoping to get a late invite. If, uh, player down in uh, North Carolina State, I believe it was. Wish he could still play for the Knicks. <laughs> they need something, <laughs> partner. As Iverson flashes in the lane. The Sixers, Allen Iverson has uh, has played very well. He set the tempo and he has completely outplayed Gilbert Arenas. It makes it very, very difficult for Washington to try to win in this building. The penetration and over the top of Brendan Haywood. The crossover, the pull up from the free throw line. Allen Iverson, 8 for 12 shooting. He's also got five assists, including this three-pointer right here. But Chris Weber's ability to find the open man, the back cut, frustrating Washington to no end and teasing the entire Washington Wizards team. Allen Iverson tonight, his shot chart, the green boxes are the makes. Look. I, I love the team game, but you've got to come head to head against the strength. As Chris Weber gets another assist, and if they didn't pick him up in time, Iverson though, uh, free throw line extended, knocking it down. He's hit two field goals. And look how Chris Weber stopped that fast break. And Fine. then Arenas nails a three ball, and maybe. But with Allen Iverson outscoring Gilbert Arenas by a three to one ratio tonight. That's a uh, sort of mimics what happens in their head to head confrontations. Beautiful setup by AI. See what knocks it down in this league. Allen Iverson has a 30 point scoring average head to head in those contests compared to just 18 for Gilbert Arenas. And a little extra motivation for the little fella here since uh, he was snubbed by the. Olympic Selection Committee and Arenas was uh, chosen. Some of the good does, How many championships does Kobe have? How many will he have now that he's without Shaquille O'Neal? But Arenas is coming up from behind. Oh, nice. Got it into Iguodala's hands. He felt he felt the pressure on his back that time. And then he shovels it off to Iguodala. Look every, at Arenas close. Every time, every dribble was with the other hands. So if it, somebody was coming up, nobody had a chance to read what he was going to do. This guy is special, and he's on his way to the Basketball Hall of Fame. He's got a lot of years left in the NBA. I was on to this day doesn't have. And this defensive matchup, you got Jared Jeffries at seven feet tall out in front against Allen Iverson. And he drains a three. Yeah, if they can if they can somehow get Arenas into a flow here, and Jamison continues firing away like that, Daniels. Give him a fresh chance to tie it with a three here. Oh, oh. man. <laughs> Look at what I've got. Oh, oh baby. <laughs> Allen Iverson. <laughs> <and dunk. laughs> Watch Daniels. He just doesn't say <laughs> and he just basically gives it to him. When you intercept the ball with your stomach, that is great defense. Allen hangs on the rim and the rim doesn't even bend. <laughs> That's how light he is. I, how much do you think he weighs? 145, 150 yeah. pounds? Yeah, sure. No more than that. Neither of them uh, put on. would just lay it right in their hands time and time again. Played high school basketball here in Philly at Overbrook High and was recruited by and leave the Jayhawks and was unable to do so and that's why he wound up playing for the Harlem Globetrotters for a uh, year as Renus with a pretty rhythm shot keep numerous occasions when you look at the scoreboard the Wizards are right there with them. Last shot time that's why uh, they've spread the floor. Iguodala what defensive capabilities. Oh, left hand driving layup makes it a two. That good of basketball. And three through nine in the Eastern Conference is just throw the cards up in the air right now. Oh, Allen Iverson, what a move. Allen Iverson makes it 95 90, a 40 point night for AI. Allen Iverson move. <laughs> threw his legs. Oh, he, he, mercy. Makes, he makes Antonio Daniels. Drove him to the hardwood. <laughs> well, <laughs> look at that. But, and look at the, look at the crowd. Look at the, look at the reaction <laughs> over there. Are you kidding me? Uh, hey, Antonio Daniels is a top tier defensive player. But he just fell down trying to guard Allen. At the other end, Arenas for the lead. 96-95, Washington.
All right, John, and here, Gilbert Arenas and the Wizards have taken a lead. Arenas started 4 of 15. Iverson's been on fire all night. But since then, Gilbert Arenas, 4 of 4, 15 of his 22 have come in this half. And Gilbert Arenas has been on a personal 6-0 run in the last 50. That's 5-0, 50 seconds here as the Washington Wizards and remarkably come right back in, in what, 6-9? You know, they have no chance at... Earlier, we mentioned that Allen Iverson is fifth all-time in 40-plus games. Eton Thomas, you'd think he'd be able to throw that one back down for a stick back. Iverson driving for 44. 103-99. Allen Iverson, he goes by the entire team. This is the great circle route. Good. That would have put him on a 45 if he hit that first one. Well, we got a ton of time here for Allen Iverson. There he is, 45 now. Iverson on the little fade in the lane. It's 47. Iverson, 17 of 26. He's hit a pair of threes. 11 of 12 at the free throw line. Those 10 assists, two turnovers, 47 points. And nailing the two is under this game. Gilbert Arenas was averaging a little over 30 points per game against Eastern Conference teams since his All Star snub. Remember, he was not voted by the fans into the game or by coaches. He said to me before the game, "I still got to make them pay. I can't." Eat. The Wizards will badly need a field goal. Mr. Last five, spot three. Arenas, huge, good. It's a two. Now let me correct that. It was a two. Arenas has missed four. Free throws here tonight. The season 83% shooter. The poise and confidence of a man who truly believes in Jason Bill with 47 here tonight. Doing it all, and these are all shots from the second half alone. How you play basketball, how you control the biggest of stages, stealing passes with his stomach, and then the flush to throw it down. Allen Iverson teasing everybody. It's not how high you jump, it's when you jump. The little flick just off the floor, breaking Antonio Daniels' ankles there as he gets in the lane, regular trip to the free throw line. 47 points, 26 this half long, 47 points on 26 shot attempts, 11 assists, and only three turnovers. He's had the ball in his hands all night long. Out of the game, so he'll take a seat, 152, and that could be, yeah. that could. The problem is that Iguodala can only guard one guy. Because, you know, you got Jamerson who, but Gilbert Arenas has that combination of balance and quickness that you have to have to be a great player. Weber's open. Iverson threw the double team and made a terrific pass to his open big man. Penetration and dish one more time. What puts you over the top? The three from Arenas is good. And it's a one-point game here. And Philadelphia are going to beat the Wizards for the first time this season. 1.6 left. <laughs> and an ovation from the fans as Allen Iverson with a 47-point night high fives the front row customers. What a performance. What a champion. Gilbert Arenas frustrated. Big night for him. Slow start for Gilbert. Worked his way to 33 points. Eight assists. Well, again, 119-113. Allen Iverson, C. Webb, and the 76ers win it. For more now, tune to ESPN News. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. The Clippers and the Jazz are coming up next. Let's take you out to Salt Lake City now. And here is Jim Durham. Take it away, Jim.